mechanics okay together to process plan that is my if you you have that mindset i'm happy okay it's it's not just like try 100 tests sometimes it will work sometimes it will not work okay you you have to plan are we clear right so next thing we're going to go is we are going to go into heat treatment a different topic now heat treatment is different but similar to what we have spoken about okay so we're going to look at heat treatment So when we talk about heat treatment, I, I, I know that's me. I always think about heating, right? Heat treatment, heating. No, 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 no. Heat treatment is not just about heating. It's also about what? Cooling, okay? So heat treatment. Okay, heat treatment are process. Of. Uh, control heating and cooling okay so don't just think about temperature go up okay to change uh, material microstructure And more as important, not more important, mechanical properties. Okay, that's what. So after heat treatment, okay, the change. in shape and geometry dimension are not desired okay. Okay. 95% of the time not desired. Five percent of the time is desired. Can you can you think of which five percent after heat treatment you want it to change the shape? Anyone? Some most of the time, okay, you don't need to change the shape most of the time, but sometimes changing shape is a good thing. Can you think of anything? You play computer games, sword fighting games. What's the difference between a ninja sword and a samurai sword? Any idea? One is straight, the ninja sword is what? Straight. The samurai sword is what? Curve. How do they get it to curve? Hey, heat treat. You heat it up, it won't bend. It's when you quench. Okay, they quench at a certain, they have a certain way of quenching. Okay, all this you can YouTube the shit out of it, you can see it. Okay? And when they quench, there's a technique where they quench the out form of the shape is what the sword is what bad. So that's why I, I say down here, 95% is just just to show you most of the time you 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 don't want to change. But sometimes you want it to what? When it change. Okay. The textbook always say are not desired. Uh, no, that's not true, right? Sometimes you want it to happen. So, note 
An important, uh, important thing to take note is this note. Right? The higher the holding temperature, okay, before quenching, I put rapid cooling. Right, the greater right, is the possibility in change of dimensions. shape or physical cracking okay so the material were, were more likely to crack right if your holding temperature is what is too high okay once you quench the possibility of it cracking is very high that's why now if we look at Uzbo, they are pretty smart yes or no Right, they add manganese to lower the what? Phase transformation temperature. For that reason also, because Uzbo, what's the problem with Uzbo? If we look at Uzbo, right, if we look at Uzbo, what happened? They add manganese, right, to lower the what? Phase transformation temperature. Okay, so when they lower the phase transformation temperature, they heat up the arsenide, and then when they quench, you won't get what? Cracking. Okay. You know, it's interesting when I talk about Uzbo, I have students saying me like, when they went to this course eight years ago, when they see me, you know what they say? Eugene, Uzbo! You know, you always remember. <laughs> when I see my gadget students or my students who are graduating, hey, Eugene, how's Uzbo? I'm like, really, really, really? Okay. <laughs> The Uzbo, right? Hey, no, 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 no. They, 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 they. Because of this cause, they, they hear so much Uzbo, it and engraved into their mind. And I will, I believe it's the same for you, you guys. Okay, you see me later on in industry. You tell me, Eugene, Uzbo, Eugene, Uzbo, right? So now. I will try to sketch our beloved diagram. So in heat treatment, uh, a very important aspect is phase diagram. You all know that, right? Now, did Gordana teach you all a lot of, on heat treatment in materials or no? In structure and properties of material, were you all taught a lot of heat, about heat treatment? No? Oh. Yes? Some say no, some say yes. Are you in the same school or not? Right. It's okay. If not, we... we so, this is 100, 200. Seven. Eight hundred. Nine hundred. We kept it at a thousand. So we, uh, this is 0 0.2, 0 0.4. I don't know have enough not. 0 0.2, 0 0.4, 6, 8. I have enough. 1.2, 1 1.4, 1 1 1.6, 1.8, 2.0, and I'm going to start at 2.11. This is percentage of carbon. This is my temperature. We see. Then we have two lines. A 0.77 line. Hmm. 
then we have a sketch on our seven two three line. And from here, so this is our 723 line. This is our 0.77. Okay. And then from here, we have a few lines to put in. Slightly more than 900, it comes down. We are going to do a lot on this diagram, okay? So draw it big. Right. So here we go. So for the first thing that we are going to do is we are going to draw a range of temperature or, or an operating range. So if you have So what you see over here, okay. So this temperature range is for full annealing. Okay. And we know on top of here, this is our austenite region. Over here is our ferrite plus perlite. On the right hand side is your cementite plus your perlite. Any idea at 0.77, if you hit and control cool, what will happen? <laughs> Depend on your luck. <laughs> Are we clear? If, if, if at 0.77, if you cool down, sometime you can have ferrite and perlite. Sometime you can have what? Cement type and, and ferrite. So, okay, so don't ask me, Eugene, on the line what happened. Okay. So, the the blue I colored that is for full annealing, okay, and then I'm going to have a a, a different color, a uh, orange, okay. So the orange will go from here to here, and then we'll follow. So this orange line that you see me coloring. Right. This is for normalizing. Okay. So we are going to we're going to step away from this diagram a bit. Okay. Later on, we got more things to put in. Okay. So before we have more things to put in, take a ten minutes break. We come back. We do more heat treatment. Yes. Yes. Yep. Yes. So the one on the right is cementite plus perlite. So having more cementite causes it to become harder. Perlite. Go for a 10 minutes break. 